What's happening, Real Filmers? I'm here at the GI Film Festival here in 2014, and I have here with me special guest Gary Sinise. How are you doing? Very good, thank you. Good. Uh, well, first off, um, you know, you've had opportunity, you've been here before. Uh, You've sponsored you sponsor this event, you know, um, what, what is it about this event, or, or should I say, has it met the expectations, you know, that you had, um, that, that you had considered for this event, you know, year, years ago, back in 2007? Um, has it met your expectations, or has it exceeded it? Yeah, the, the festival has grown quite a bit from the beginning. I was here the first year, and several years after that, I wasn't here last year, but good to be back this year, and it's grown and grown and grown. I think there's a there's a vital uh, component to this, which is that there is a big disconnect between the American people and its military. Uh, a lot of people, unless you uh, unless you have a personal relationship, a friend or a family member, or somebody who served or something, you really have a disconnection to the military. And what this does is highlights uh, positive stories, good stories of service and sacrifice and determination and resiliency and all the things that go into being a person who serves above themselves and that's what going to going to the military is and serving, serving our country and going in a harm's way why would somebody want to do that unless there was a part of themselves that was selfless and patriotic in some way and that's, that, that's what this does. It tries to highlight what it means to be a service member and that and it does that in a very positive way and it's grown and grown and grown because I think there there is a hunger to see those stories and tonight we're gonna see a great story about Travis Mills a quadruple amputee a soldier who got blown up and lost both his arms and both his legs but he's got this never quit attitude that just is is infectious and it's really a beautiful story if you get a chance to see it out there go see it Okay. All right. Well, you know, we're we're towards uh, the latter half of uh, the festival. Um, have you had opportunity to see some other films, or you know, will will this be you know your first uh, a night here uh, for the span of the festival? I'm very very busy with the Gary Sneeze Foundation and the work of the foundation, which is to serve and honor the needs of our military and our defenders and that kind of thing. So I'm traveling constantly. Last night I was in Dallas. Uh, two days in Dallas doing events there. I'm here uh, for, for tonight for the festival and tomorrow I go to work on the National Memorial Day concert. Uh, we're going to be on the air on Sunday uh, at 8 o'clock. It's the National Memorial Day concert. It's the 25th year of the concert. It'll be televised on PBS at 8 p.m. I do that. This will be my 10th year doing that. So I'm constantly traveling around doing something. I don't, don't get to see all the films obviously because of it but very busy supporting the military where I, where I can. All right, well, thank you so much, Gary. My pleasure.